So we come to the time of conferring of degrees. So will the candidates for the master's and bachelor's degrees please stand. President Wright, as Chief Academic Officer of Dallas Baptist University, it's my honor to declare officially to you that the candidates who stand before you have completed all the requirements for their bachelor's and master's degrees. Upon the recommendation of the faculty and by virtue of the authority vested in my office by the Dallas Baptist University Board of Trustees, I confer upon you the appropriate bachelor's and master degrees with all of the rights and the privileges thereto appertaining. Congratulations, graduates. You may be seated. Will the first rows of master's degree graduates please move forward at this time? Graduates, some of you have received a DBU cross ring, the official ring of Dallas Baptist University, a symbol of your Christ-centered education, the ring is to be first worn with the cross atop the ring facing towards your hearts until the completion of your DBU education and awarding of earned degrees. Following today's ceremony, per DBU tradition, your ring should be turned with the cross facing the world. This tradition symbolizes your training and calling to take Christ into the world as servant leaders. Audience, before the presentation of degrees, would you please note these general instructions for our ceremony? As each graduate walks across the stage and receives their degree, we have made arrangements for their picture to be taken. If you desire to take your own close-up photographs, we'd ask that you please wait until the conclusion of the service. We do keep the aisles clear during the ceremony, so we'd ask that you not leave your seat to take pictures or video. As many of you may be aware, some universities have both a baccalaureate religious service and a commencement ceremony for graduating students. At DBU, we view both programs to be joined together into one event. We view the graduation ceremony as a true spiritual worship experience as well as an opportunity to recognize the graduates. In that light, I'd ask you to silence your phones, uh, silence any other noisemakers or devices. We don't allow noisemakers uh, today. We'd ask that you hold your applause until the end of each degree presentation. If you would like to recognize a graduate, we'd ask that you stand quietly in place so that they will see you as they return to their seat. We'd ask that you not cheer, yell, clap, or create a loud outburst because that causes uh, often the next family to miss hearing a name being read. I commit to you that we will have an opportunity uh, to loudly congratulate uh, the graduates at the end of each degree presentation. So thank you in advance for following our instructions today. As you watch the graduates walking across the stage in a few moments, you will notice that some are wearing a medal around their neck. Students may receive honors for their academic performance in their bachelor's degree courses. Students wearing a gold medallion have graduated summa cum laude. Those wearing a silver medallion are graduating magna cum laude. And those wearing a bronze medallion are graduating cum laude. Further explanation of these honors can be found in the middle of your commencement program under the topic graduation with honors. Receiving the degree Master of Arts in Children's Ministry and receiving an accelerated degree Bachelor of Science and Master of Arts in Children's Ministry and graduating magna cum laude, Emily Ann McClure. Receiving the degree Master of Arts in Christian Ministry, Christopher Michael Ivey. Thyssen Annette Smiley Porter. Receiving the degree Master of Arts in Christian Ministry Chaplaincy, Jeremiah James O'Dell. James Henry Rutledge. Receiving the degree Master of Arts in Education Ministry Leadership, Teresa Red Morris. Jonathan Bradley Phipps. Summer Rose Waterman. Receiving the degree Master of Arts in Family Ministry, Claudia M. Gonzalez Barcinas. Judith Esther Rodriguez.
receiving the degree Master of Arts in Global Leadership and receiving an accelerated degree, Bachelor of Science and Master of Arts in Global Leadership and graduating magna cum laude, Emily Morgan Austin. Mocha Colleen. Sebastian Rodriguez. Receiving a dual degree, Master of Arts in Christian Ministry and Master of Arts in Global Leadership, B. Yak Tun. Courtney Taylor Yates. Receiving the degree, Master of Arts in Theological Studies, Michael Thomas Crumpler. Shayla Gabrielle Fuller. Patricia Ann Green. Kirby Ann Kelly. Dominic Scott Powell. Jeffrey L. Ross. Kyle David Skaggs. Deborah Takumbo Noro Shudipe. Receiving the degree Master of Arts in Worship Studies, Kristen Patricia Cardella. Amanda Faith Cook. Madeline Kate Stanton. Briona Simone Williams. David Austin Young. Receiving the degree Master of Arts in Christian Counseling, Emma Gomez Chavez. Amy Elizabeth Ann Cummings. Mark Anthony McCloskey. Receiving an accelerated degree, Bachelor of Science and Master of Arts in Christian Counseling, Joshua William Specht. Michaela C. Walker. Let's congratulate the master's degree graduates of Dallas Baptist University.